Hello, welcome to True Projects. In this video, we are going to explain about efficient storage and entity detection system for security cameras. Introduction: Two important requirements are addressed by the project. First, it uses background abstraction to detect and store only distinct frames in videos while removing comparable frames to maximize storage. The technology also includes entity recognition which employs a trained model to find and identify people in video frames. To identify each person, a special ID is given to them. The initiative intends to reduce duplicate data storage while reliably recognizing and monitoring individuals in video footage, improving storage efficiency and security in surveillance systems. Objective Through two essential needs, the project's objective is to improve security camera systems. The project's first goal is to reduce redundant data storage by using background abstraction to detect and save only unique frames in videos and optimize storage capacity. The second goal of the project is to use a trained identification model to find and identify things, humans in video frames. The system recognizes and displays the entity's ID when a clear face is identified by giving each person a special ID. The project's ultimate goal is to reduce storage consumption and precisely identify objects in security camera footage in order to increase security and storage efficiency. Requirements The requirements of the project are hardware requirements and software requirements. In hardware requirements, we have operating system windows only, processor i5 and above, RAM 4GB and above, hard disk 20GB and above. Software requirements In software requirements, we have Python IDLE with 3.7 version. Methodology To implement this project, we have designed the following module. The first module is Load Entity Detection Model. This module involves loading the Entity Detection Model, which is a machine learning model trained to identify individuals in images or video frames. The model has been trained on a set of images containing different individuals, each assigned a unique ID. Once loaded, the model can be used to recognize entities in frames from security camera footage. Second module is Efficient Storage and Entity Detection. This central module combines two key functionalities, efficient storage and entity detection. For efficient storage, the system utilizes background abstraction to identify frames that are similar to each other. Frames with similarity below a certain threshold are considered unique and safe, reducing storage space. The entity detection component uses the loaded model to identify individual spaces in frames. The recognized individuals are assigned their unique IDs based on the training data. Third module is Comparison Graph. The Comparison Graph module visualizes the effectiveness of the efficient storage technique. It presents a graph where the x-axis represents different storage types, original video versus efficient storage, and the y-axis represents storage space consumption. This graph offers a clear visual representation of the storage space saved by using the efficient storage approach compared to the original video. The graph confirms the benefits of the project storage optimization method. Execution For the execution of the project, we need to open the code folder. This is the code folder. This is the images folder in which we have the test images which we have used during the execution of the project. This is the model folder. This folder contains algorithm information. These can be loaded into the project code during runtime to utilize the train models. And this is the videos folder in which we have the test videos which we have used during the execution of the project. This is run.batch file. Instead of executing our project the command line interface, we have created windows batch file to execute the project. Double click on run.batch file. A graphical user interface will pop up. This is the graphical user interface which we have created using Tikenta library in Python. Using this GUI, we will interact with the project. Click on load entity detection model to load the model. So here we can see that the model is loaded. Now click on efficient storage and entity detection to load video and check frames and then recognize entities. I'm selecting the first video open. So here we can see that the video is loaded. 
and in the video we can see that old and current frame look similar so here we can see that the person one is detected and the person one is having a unique id one so in this way we will detect the person and each person will be given a unique id so here difference detected in frame so this person's face is not clear so we will detect the person space in a very clearer way and then a unique id will be given to the person so here we can see that this person is also detected and a unique id is given to him so here we can see that both these persons are detected and a unique id is given to them so in this way we will detect the person's face and a unique id will be given to them now close the video now click on comparison graph so here we can see that this is the comparison graph of existing and efficient storage size graph so the x axis represents the storage type and y axis represents storage space and in both efficient storage techniques taking less space similarly we can upload and test other videos now close the graph note while running application it has to detect faces and recognize them so video processing will be little slow now close the gui and the final conclusion of the project is the project provides security camera systems with a dual purpose solution first it uses background abstraction and frame similarity checks to implement efficient storage storage requirements are drastically reduced because frames with less than 65% similar similarity are kept as individual frames second a trained model is used by the system to detect and identify entities each entity has a distinct id locate allocated to it for identification by utilizing these tools the project maximizes storage space use usage and improves security by precisely identifying people the comparison graph illustrates the improvement in storage efficiency overall the project provides an all inclusive method of streamlining security camera operations while ensuring efficient entity detection and storage management thank you for watching video for more projects please visit our website www.trueprojects.in For updates on latest project videos, please visit True Projects YouTube channel and subscribe.